dinner is served. But before we get into that, time to go over the Texas Terry Labonte installment of Pivoting on Fox. Emily debuted it tonight. Andrea returned. Tansy debuted it tonight. What more can you ask for? Although, to be fair, tonight, even during the Nickelodeon portion, I was kind of quiet because when I turned on the TV, I was just waking up, you know, considering I would sleep through my shows. And, you know, nothing crazy funny happened tonight, so that's why I was kind of chill. But anyway, so, you know, Amy was pretty good at lying, you know, considering that, you know, even though, it taught, I mean, Henry did find out. Henry did find out, you know, that you know that Gloria wasn't sick and all this other stuff. And I do commend him for teaching or telling Amy, hey, we shouldn't be teaching our son Luke how to lie and shit. But I don't think he I don't think he said the S word, but that's basically how he meant it the way he said it. But yeah. It's kinda of like what we learned on the Goldbergs yesterday, you know, during the double header, you know. You know how, you know, we always talk about how we, yesterday we talked about always tell your girlfriend or boyfriend right away if you, like, kissed another man or a woman. You won't get in as much trouble with him, him slash her, and guys will still stay together no matter what. Well, it's the same thing as an as a kid and an adult. You know, tonight just proved, I also proved that from last night, as a continuation, continuation from last night, that uh, this applies to adults too. Always tell the truth first. That way you won't, you won't get in as much trouble as you would if you just lie the whole time you know you know considering that you know to avoid getting in trouble but then when the truth finally comes out you're in a lot of trouble the more trouble than you should be compared if you tell the truth first the same way you shouldn't keep a secret from your boyfriend or girlfriend for like a week even if the truth is the first and only thing that comes out you'll still get in a lot of trouble with your boyfriend or girlfriend and they'll more likely break up with you but that was yesterday tonight was about you know and um what was the, what else did we see from tonight's episode oh yeah um no matt tonight no matt no matt. and i'm surprised that andrea never stepped foot in her room and when the ladies were like in like taking it taking it over but the, emily debuted it in style tonight where she got to babysit luke and his little baby sister which i thought was pretty cool and you know, poor. Gl I feel bad for Gloria not being able to watch them this time. You know, because Luke approved of Emily being younger and more energetic. I mean, no offense to Gloria, because Connie Jackson seems like a nice lady in real life, and Gloria seems nice in character. But I felt so bad for her. You know, and um, I did miss my man JT Neal tonight, but there's really not much to talk about. I mean, it was a chill episode and everything. It was quiet and everything. Tansy and, um, you know, um, oh my god, what's Maggie Q's character's name? I know jo Jody is Jennifer Goodwin and Amy is Liza Koo. Sarah. Okay, yeah, Sarah. All right. So Sarah and Tansy got to have some have to have a moment in the bathroom together. We're not gonna we're not gonna know what is why because you know to keep a T V fourteen rated they have to keep it semi clean you know and you know the fact that you know you Sarah got Sarah got to take off her shirt and shit to keep a T V fourteen. I can understand people say frustrated saying just show us the shit anyway and I understand the frustration but to keep it a TV fourteen rating you got to censor some stuff. I mean as much as I hate censorship as much as the next guy if it was streaming you know you got like a Stream exclusive where it never hit the, the internet like the national airwaves fine go ahead and do some uncensored shit and cuss all your on sale all of every word in the book all you want but to keep it tv 14 we got to keep it semi-clean you can say every bad word except the f word you know considering danger force tonight had two cuss references even though i should have talked about that in the previous video but there really isn't much to talk about tonight because you know i mean sure we got to see andrea you know and that buzzing thing on you know that looked like it was upstairs it was upstairs it actually was under the sink but jody did a good job keeping it from andrea but whatever andrea ordered it had to take back i hope that goes well for her but Really not much to talk about tonight. I'm just gonna eat my dinner, drink my coke, and like watch all my favorite YouTubers and you know try to friend you know all the people from some tonight shows on all social media tonight. So have a good night tonight and a better day tomorrow. Life will give you a lot of lows, but when you hit a high, enjoy it. And it for the week.
goddamn be you. You have to try harder to do less. So take care, everyone. Good night. And for the pivoting folks, I will see you all next week for the, whatchamacallit, the episode Mark Martin installment of the new comedy series. And next week, don't forget the Kelly Berglund Spurs Cavs banger on, the, on February 9th, which I think is, um, Hold on, let me check it out like Captain LePage. Yes, it's a Wednesday and there's no Goldbergs episode, so I won't be missing anything. And the next episode of Pivoting the Mark Martin installment will be February 10th, the Crotch of Doom's birthday. Um, I'll find a way to sneak my birthday, my you know, little... I may not be able to, may not or may or may not be able to bring you guys um, the next Nickelodeon Thursday Night in America installment live, nor an episode of Mike Martin of Pivoting Live. So I might have to do it next Friday because I want to, like, you know, focus on wishing the Crouch of Doom and his oldest daughter, Dalen Baker, a happy birthday, you know, since, you know, I wasn't able to visit Dalen on her real birthday, considering the weather was so bad and either that or she was never home because, you know, she was out during her senior, not her senior high school festivities, but. I will bring you a video of that instead, and then Friday we'll do the Nickelodeon Thursday night and pivoting episode Mark Martin a day later. So that's all I will say for now. So see you later, everyone.